Cassie here. So, if you feel like you don't have a routine right now, like you're just kind of picking some blog a lot of these videos and kind of doing them, that's fine, but it is a lot more successful for you and your fitness journey if you're following something. So, if you are new to the channel, I want you to go to blogalotes.com and download my new workout calendar. It literally tells you exactly what to do every single day so you get a full body workout in the entire week. It's awesome. I've got your cardio and your muscle toning all covered in there. And if you're not doing that, well then you better be doing pit 28. And uh, my pitsters know that stuff is hard. But anyway, let's talk about today's workout. It is quick burn booty time. All new moves. You don't even need a yoga mat. We're standing for the most part. Wear some shoes if you feel like you need more grip. Otherwise, your little feet are fine too. So let's go ahead and get started. Guys, the first move is called the push peddler squat. These are new and so fun. So legs are hip width apart, okay? Shoulders back, open up the chest, belly button in. Now go ahead and lift up one heel like you're wearing a stiletto. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna bring your arms in front and you're simply gonna squat down. And then you're gonna squat down, switch the heel and squat. And as you can see, you are push pedaling. Yes, just like that. So guys, the reason why we do this is because you can feel it all the way up your calves, through your hamstrings, through your quads, and of course, yabote. It is a complete lower body move. And look, even if you guys are looking to work your butt, you gotta work those muscles around it because it all is working together. The stronger everything is, the stronger and more lifted your booty will look. Now I'm gonna turn to the side so you can see what this looks like. As you can see, the heels are lifting. And I don't want you to give me, you know, little kitten heels. I want you to give me big stripper heels all the way up. Good, come on, up, up. Ooh, was that too much, was that too much? <laughs> okay, maybe you can give me like Valentino heels. Okay, come on, down and down. Give me eight, seven, six. What are you push pedaling? Is it a cycle? Is it a, uh, a boat? Is it a sewing machine? <laughs> give me three, two, one, and lift. Woo! You feel that? Crazy stuff. Okay, now, next move is kind of funny, okay? This one is called puppet legs. So legs are gonna be hip width apart again. Same deal up here, hands in front. Starting out in that low squat. Now you wanna stay there. You're gonna bring it out and in, and out and in. Your goal is to not move how tall you are. Okay, stay low. Woo! I'm feeling those thighs. And make sure you're pivoting through your heel, not through your toes. My toes have basically lifted up. Okay, whoo! Come on, out and in, and out and in. So out into that, almost like a second position, diagonal out, and then into that squat with the feet forward. Now keep that chest open, shoulders away from the ears. I tell you this all the time. It feels better for your back, and that is a proper alignment. Oh my goodness. Okay, now because you're advanced, you're advanced now, we're gonna pick up the speed. Here we go. Out and in, out and in. OMG, that's crazy. Eight, seven, six, come on. Five, four, three, two, one, and hold it and lift. Woo! Okay, our final move. Our final move is the tip over. Go ahead and lift up one leg, and what I want you to do is simply Bend down, touch the floor, and then whoo, lift it up right here, okay? Lots of butt and hamstrings and core balance. Let's do it. I'm gonna go ahead and reach down, tap, and lift. You're going to inhale, down, exhale, up. Bringing my elbows all the way up to my shoulders to make sure that I'm truly standing tall. <sighs> And lift, very good. Now you may find it a little bit hard to stay balanced, but that's okay. If you tip over, all you have to do is get back up again. No big deal. The more you practice, the easier this is gonna get. Do so you feel that leg working? I'm feeling that leg working so much. Keep going. And down, tap, a slight tap, beautiful. And I want you to hold right here, hands on the hips, flex the foot, now, extension, extension, okay? All that booty, whoa, almost fell. <laughs> Woo, oh, oh my gosh, I look at you and then I almost fall. Okay, hands on the hips, and we are extending and in, extending and in. If you need to hold onto a wall, go ahead and do that. Give me five, flex 
the foot. Four, nice. Three, good. Two, one more. One and down. Woo! Were you burning? Cause I was burning. Hands here. Go ahead and lift up the leg. Delicate. Here we go. And down. Elbows up. And we're down. Elbows up. Now whether or not you choose to extend your leg here or keep it bent, it doesn't really matter. The core stabilization is happening and the butt work is happening when you tip over right here and you use your strength to pick yourself back up, okay? And up, woo! You know, you have a tip moment like that and you just, you just put your mind to it and try not to fall over. Wow. See, it's totally normal, it happens all the time. Focus, focus. Imagine right here, it's gonna hold you down. It's gonna center you, okay? No wind can blow you over because you're stronger than that. And even if it does, maybe you waver a little bit. But that's okay, because you know where your balance is. You know where your center is. And you will find your core again, okay? Give me one more right here. Whoa, I got too excited there. One more. Okay, and here. Now, lift up, straighten that back. Straighten that chest, flex the foot, and we're out and in. Out and in, in our hamstring curls, single-legged T-stand, so many things going on right now. Give me four, whoo, and three, come on, you got this. And two, give me one more good one, one more good one. One, and down, whoo, those legs are on fire, that booty's on fire. Guys, I hope you really enjoyed this. Thank you so much for taking the time to work out with me today. I want you to keep working hard and having fun when you work out because if you're not smiling, you keep looking. There's something out there for you. Okay, I love you so much and I'll see you next time. Bye.